This is Bruce from Bruce's Outdoors. We are on our way out clamming on the Pacific Ocean here in Oregon. Me and my grandson. So we're going to be showing you some video of how we dig these clams and hopefully we'll have a clam feed tonight. Well, we're heading out here to go dig clams. We're here on the Oregon coast at Neetarts Bay. You see how that's going, Julius? Yeah. Now what? Come up here. Didn't came very good. His hands are good. Ooh. What was that? The clam. The clam. What was the spray? Yeah. So then you follow that hole. Oh. He was digging back off in the ground, or taking his neck back in the ground. There's his neck. Grab him. Still quite a bit down there. So then just be careful and dig beside both sides of him. Because you'll break them with your hand. Oh, there's a big one that's messing around. There he is. All these butters, they're just small. Look at this one. This one big yeah, that's perfect. That's what we're after for the butters. This guy's right here. He has a big neck. I should let the boys get him, I guess. Which one of you wants this? Come on. Put them down and come on over here. Put your shovel down and get in there like Dustin and D. Dustin will show you. Do you see him? No. That's him right there. So you got to dig beside him on both sides like this. And get him out. Come over here where I'm at. Don't lose him. All right, Julius is in here after a, a big fat clam. Woo, look at this worm, boy. What you feel it? He's right here. Hold your head up a little bit so I can see. All right, there you go. Oh, mud. Collapsing. Yeah, you got to dig quick so you can get him out. Don't break it. Now wiggle him. I think he'll come out of there, Julius. Oh, no. You coming? Still tight. I'm still tight? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when you're digging your horse neck, you don't want to be distracted with butters or losing. Is this him right here? Yeah. So then you just get in this crack and tape it off. You might see his neck. Both sides. I think that's his neck right there. Ooh, he's a fat one. You get him? So see how you're flooding your hole? Yeah. Julie's hole's flooding. What do you do? Is that the big one? Yeah. All right. Where? All right, now film me over there. Get back over there and film me. Oh, there he is, right there, Albert. Got him. You still feeling me on me? Huh? Mm -hmm. Got him. This is a, I don't know what kind it is, but I got one. That's a little caper. Foot. Don't want to be on video. No, I don't care. This is my brother. We're out here digging in Oregon Knee Tarts Bay. We're digging uh, clams. He had a big... I think they're called horse neck, and uh, he's still hunting for them. But he's got two nice butter clams here in the bucket. You better drain some of that water. 
Is it waterproof? Yeah, but I'm gonna need some salt water on. All right, we're out here digging clams, and the way you do it is you stick your finger in these holes, and when they suck back in, it tells you there's a clam there, and then you start to dig. So you just wander around sticking your fingers in holes. You gotta just go like this and get that side broke loose, and then you go to this side. Oh, he's big. Now here he is. There wow! He is. Some big one. Look at that. Hold, hold. Julie's finally got to him. He's a big old fat. I think these are called horse neck. Why is he squirting? Here for these clamps. I got my hole opened up. Oh, there's a nice one. Oh, got another one. All right. Find lots of small ones, but these are too small, so we're gonna we're gonna put these back. All right, no, that's good. All right, we're digging on one here. This one was close to surface. You gotta ask Dustin. I don't know if that's big enough. All right, Albert, get in there with your hands. Is this big enough? I I would throw that one back. Oh, you sand out, Albert. Don't throw it. Just put, it Just put him down because you'll break him. You got to dig quick. See how your stuff is falling in? There you go. And your hole was right there, so. He quit squirting, so now I'm just trying to find him. Right in there, Albert. That's where he was at. Dig. You gotta dig fast so you can see if you see his neck. Right. Look right. Yeah, right. One more. Right this way. You feel him? Keep going. I see it move. Ain't that him? Keep going. Right in there. Over this way just a little bit. You feel it? I don't know, but I feel it. Keep going. Is your watch waterproof? Yeah. I might be doing a Tyson here. You don't feel nothing? Uh. You can also see them squirt water up. And I just saw one squirt up right here, and I'm going to see if I can get it. They squirt water up. I hope you can see some of the water squirting up. That's another way you can find them. Of course, every time I moved, then they squirt. There's some kind of worm we dug up in the sand. I think it's a kelp worm. I won't swear to it, but I think that's what it is. Oh, look at him moving. Oh, Lord. Julius, grab him. No, he looks too ugly. Seen anything. I got one on the side. Christ. Get that thing off of me. Wow. Alright, let's look at that. Albertson here. Getting the clams. Hold up some of them you big ones you done got, Albert. Let's see a couple of the big ones. There's a couple nice big ones Albert just got up. All right. Here's Julius with a really nice clam he just dug up. As you can see, he's enjoying himself. He's all muddy and dirty. This is a map to where we were out clamming. All right, 
right, we had a great day of clamming here on the Oregon coast. We're at Neatarts Bay. We all got our limits of clam. Now we're gonna go home and clam and make some clam strips and maybe some clam chowder. Well, we are got our clams and Julius, get out of that water. Leave <laughs> that baby alone. You dirty sucker. <laughs> Julius, you're just like your grandpa. No, he ain't. He was just dirty like that. Dog. <laughs> There was some dirt. You, you. Yeah, that's well, way better, baby. It's not noisy in the living room at all. Get ready to clean our clams. Clams we caught this morning out on the Oregon coast. My first time doing it in a long time. So. Kind of just peel them out of there, and there's a couple muscles holding stuff. This is this one. I think this guy's gonna be. All right, now we're cleaning our clams here. Pretty easy. But hard. There's our meat. So we're all finished cleaning our clams. Got quite a pile of meat here. Well, all finished. Got the clams all clean, ready to eat. So now all we gotta do is go get some grease and put them in the grease. <laughs>